Hello and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. I want to talk about something uh, that's actually struck me pretty lately, especially today. And that is, is Coinbase trying to take down Binance? Or um, realistically, is uh, the US government helping with that too? I know some of the Binance fight is probably from FTX cronies uh, that are mad that Binance took them down by exposing them, so they're trying to get some revenge. But I've seen a lot of uh, stuff on Twitter of people fighting Binance and then saying Coinbase is the only safe exchange out there. And that gets me thinking. Now, do I think Brian Armstrong's the one behind this? No, I don't think the CEO is behind this, but it could be investors or it could be other people affiliated with Coinbase or something. It could also be um, like U.S. government people because the U.S. government would much prefer that Coinbase dominate the space instead of Binance because Coinbase is much easier to control than Binance since Binance is not situated in the United States. Remember, um, Russia is actually using, you know, like Bitcoin and crypto to actually like get around U.S. sanctions. And Binance did actually refuse the government's request to actually sanction uh, Russian users. So they might have an ax to grind. So like, I don't really know if it's like some like Coinbase aficionados working with the U.S. government in conjunction to actually try to like FUD Binance. Whatever they're doing, it's really not working all that well because Binance, BNB coins actually like recovered mostly and you can't depeg BUSD because it's actually um, supported by USD. But right now, like outside of maybe like former FTX people trying to FUD Binance, I see a lot of actually like people trying to FUD Binance and saying Coinbase is the only safe exchange. Now for disclosure, I don't hold anything in Binance. I do have some Dogecoin on Coinbase and I do believe Coinbase is safe at that, but I also believe Binance is fairly safe for the most part. Also, I do actually believe Dogecoin is one of those coins that isn't going to be targeted by the SEC because they didn't really have an airdrop. And uh, because the SEC basically has no one to sue. So if they actually win the Ripple case, I think Dogecoin will be one of the few coins that's actually like left out in the open. And that's actually like not actually being targeted. So I'm okay with holding my uh, Dogecoin on Coinbase because they might be forced to shut down all the trading besides the coins that are definitely not going to be securities if Ripple loses the case. But anyways, like I just find it really interesting that a lot of the people that are actually trying to FUD Binance are saying that Coinbase is the only safe exchange out there. And that really gets me to thinking that like maybe some investors may be in collaboration with people that want to get rid of Binance for uh, in governmental purposes or stuff like that is actually trying to take out Binance uh, because like they want a big US exchange to rule. And like Coinbase would actually like it if Binance just disappeared. Um, and left them all that market space to actually expand themselves. Because let's not forget, Coinbase is very much restricted by U.S. rules and regulations, so they aren't that competitive with Binance um, in the first place. So that's kind of like my thought on the issue. There might be definitely some like wrangling there, and there's a lot of like infighting within the exchanges right now. And I don't think I don't really think Brian Armstrong's or like Coinbase officially is part of this, but I do think there are like definitely collaborators that are affiliated with maybe with Coinbase that are trying to fud Binance right now and uh, trying to bring it down. And they see like the FTX fud that the, the fud that the FT, former FTX people are creating on Binance, maybe the F, SBF cronies, and they're trying to like tack onto that. But their their um, attempt to depeg BUSD obviously isn't going to work. And their attempt to FUD BNB down isn't really working all that well either. And I think they're just overall going to fail in what they're trying to do. But just uh, like, like food for thought, maybe like I don't have any real evidence that like, you know, Coinbase is trying to take down Binance. But just a lot of the threads on Twitter seem to be like a bunch of Coinbase supporters essentially like trashing Binance. So that's the news for today. Let me know what you think. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and, thank you and have a nice day.